morning after now we've all woke up uh, thanks to Bucky everyone has a cold Josh has the flu like he yeah. had demonic snores last night he's that ill yeah so what happened was you know I my nose is stuffed I'm facing my back and I'm like this <sighs> <laughs> louder than that yeah way Bro, but it was deep it was like <laughs> I couldn't breathe, so that, that was it. But it was the best sleep I've had since I've been on this trip, a proper eight hours. I've been sleeping four hours or five hours every night. Time zones are really hard for me to adjust to. I'm so glad I'm you slept now. well. I slept well. Uh, what about anyone else? No, though? no one else you know, did. It sounded like there was a fucking demon next to me. <laughs> All night, just. <sighs> <laughs> so today we are off to somewhere called Salida Turtles. It's like, um, it's a massive underground mine. It's been mined for like a thousand years. And it got turned into a theme park. I'm gonna drop some more history after. This is actually all salt and it's quite common. It actually comes off. Yeah, this is quite common practice to actually lick the walls. Uh, I'm going to avoid licking the walls today. No, oh, we're okay. actually fine now. We are in Romania. Oh. So it's weird. Let it's wet. Oh, wow. It's actually growing on it. It's crystallizing on the side of the road. It's attached itself to it, hasn't it? So, if you're new to the channel, my name is Dan. I am Exploring with Fires, and this is the underground theme park. Where does that lead to? Dude, I have no idea. This is just a big maze. Should we go down there? You think that's bad? Look at that. It's all salt growing on it. Lick it. No. <laughs> Yo, watch out, because these stairs, it's all salt. Go deeper underground. Oh! Wow, I can see the theme park. Dude, there's a freaking elevator on this side. Oh my god! Dude! There's a theme park at the bottom. Yeah. I think this is where the Ferris wheel is. This is insane! I was like, like some, some, yeah, some, some secret government lab. All this is, it's just all covered in salt. Dude, coming to Romania for this is just perfect. Praise the salt god. Yeah, salt god's here. So this was actually nicknamed Romania Zero Fifty One. Just as how secret it was when they were first building it, didn't want anyone to know. I mean, the mine was here for a thousand years. But when they were building this underground theme park attraction, they kept it so secret. A lot of the people thought this was the year 51 of Romania. So if you are new to the channel, my name is Dan and I am Exploring with Fighters. I travel around the world, documenting, filming, exploring, adventuring, all the best places I can find. Abandoned, haunted, secret, whatever it is. If it spikes interest in the imagination, and, uh, and if this is also the first video you've seen of mine, I'm currently on a road trip. I've road trip from UK through France, Belgium, Germany, Austria, Hungary, Hungary, into Romania. And we're currently doing two weeks in Romania, exploring all the craziest secret, haunted and abandoned locations they have. When this was an active salt mine, this was actually a one of a kind. This was uh, basically an extractor. This is to take salt and take it out of the mine. And apparently, it's the only one left in Romania. Apparently, Europe. Amazing, it's still standing. I mean, look at the state. It looks like it's just been propped up with bits of wood by just random people, but this is actually a sophisticated machine, believe it or not. This is one of the old mine carts that used to ship the massive rocks of salt out. Lost, I don't even know where to go. Yeah, I don't know where to go either. There's like, everywhere you go, there's like three other rooms. Within another room, there's another room. So you can only imagine how big it is. 
And if you didn't already know, I'm currently road tripping with Exploring with Josh, Exploring with Cody, and Exploring with Bucky. Everyone is making their own videos, different takes on this place. We're probably gonna split up at one point and cover different areas, so make sure you go and check out everyone else's videos. Uh, some kind of tunnel. Probably went down to lower mines. Right now we're entering something called the echo chamber. No idea what it is. Oh, here. Yeah. What do you mean? It's the echo chamber. You guys ever see the Grinch? Yeah. You're an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Subscribe. Like. Comment. Yo, it's so slippy in here. I don't know how Cody and Josh are managing in them tra uh, trainers. But me and Bucky, we are repping the shoes that um, we are repping the shoes that Polly Mill gave us. I'm repping 511, and Bucky's got some Viper ones on. I'll drop a link in the description below. No, it's really blue down here. Watch out! We're going straight down. Oh my God! Oh, this is a cool view. Yeah, I don't know what you're looking at, but I want to see. Let me see what we're looking at. Look at them wearing these shoes. Oh, right now, it's so high. No wonder the people of Romania thought there was some kind of Area 51 going on down here. Look at all them stairs they've got to walk down. Holy crap! So Bucky's really struggling here because it, I've got to admit it is very, very weird being on these it's literally just sleepers as you can see and just planks of wood but these wood feels it feels really old but you can see through it yeah it's just a it's just like a 400 400 foot drop i know it's super thin i know i know bucky i'm surprised you even made it here if you're walking if you look on the other side that's what we're walking on just wood but it's like pretty thin yeah you best off standing towards the wall standing where the babes yeah <laughs> Don't bounce on it, I'll bang. <laughs> <laughs> the evil laugh of Josh. <laughs> yeah, I only got like uh, five hours sleep last night because Josh was snoring, literally like a demon. It sounded like someone was trying to crawl out of him. Oh wow, this feels weird. I'm not even joking, this is a tragedy where it's happening. Look at that. There's a big Ferris wheel down there. Oh, How are you finding it? Horrible. I'm not enjoying it one bit. Are <laughs> you not? Nope. Wait till we get on the floor, you will. Where that goes? What are these holes? What are them holes? Oh, is that, is it? Oh, you'd, have thought that, you'd have thought that all the water, like the moisture and the salt would have rotted it, yeah. Well, maybe it helps preserve it, I don't know. Leave a comment below. What do you think? Would it preserve it or rot it? I mean, because all this wall is literally dirty. It's wet and well. dirty. I mean, look at this. It's so dirty and wet. So we've walked down this rickety pathway here. It is really, really scary. In fact, Bucky, Bucky's hit. Bucky's, oh, Bucky's holding on over there. But as you can see, there's, there's rides and stuff going on. There's kids playing down there. There's, there's an amphitheater. There's rides. And there's a deeper part over there. It's just, it's never ending. And it's amazing how it's perfectly cut as well. Yeah, that's me camera. You don't want to lean over. I think that's a better picture. <laughs> he got in the water. Yeah, it doesn't help. Every time someone steps on these boards, they all flex and move. Yeah, I know. And as you can see, if you fall through one, you're probably going to go through them all. So we're going to try and 
Let's get a bit further down. It's a long way down, guys. A long way down. You ready, Josh? Born. To make the descent? Born ready, bro. Let's go. Down the stairs. Came right from the top of there. And now we're here, at the bottom. Well, no, it's not even the bottom. It's still a part down there. I can see the goes even further, deeper, underground. Oh wow, look at the size of this ferris wheel. I've never been a fan of ferris wheels, especially rusty salty ones. Should I get on it? Leave a comment below, should I get on the ferris wheel? I don't know, I'm not sure. Just look at this place. It is, it's just absolutely amazing. I can just stand looking at the ceiling and the roof and the atmosphere around for hours. I believe there's actually boats, there's people rowing in boats down there. Leave a comment below, should we go on a boat? Yeah, I think so too. I'm definitely going to go on one of them boats. That looks so fun. Yo Josh, we've got to go on a boat. Yo, we should do a boat. Oh, it's gonna, you know what it's gonna bring back? What? Car cave vibes. Yeah, you're right. Memories are floating around the car cave. It's not quite as toxic as the, uh, the car cave. That was quite the trip, huh? Unreal. That was that was something. Yeah. Fifteen lead per boat. Yeah. They're pushed in front of. For some reason in Romania, I don't know what it is. Is it customary? People just really push in front of you, um, whether they're in cars or queues. Like blatantly, the woman just pushed in front of Josh and Cody and stood there and looked like we was in the wrong. It's just really strange. I don't know if... Let me know in the comments below if you're from Romania and this is common practice. Oh, Bucky! Get him rolling! There's no room to actually roll. Do you not know how to roll? I'm rolling on, aren't I? Row, row, row a boat. Yeah, the woman in front of Josh and, and Cody pushed in front and then as soon as we left, the guy and the kid just dived in front of it. It was quite funny, actually. Like they try anything to try anything to push in front of. What do you think? I think they do. Yeah, it's weird. You've done it a lot though, haven't you? Yeah, I don't know if it's because we're tourists or what, but I'm I'm to the point now. I don't let them pass at all. Go under the bridge, Bucky. Come on, get rolling. Hold on, I can't roll yet. Go on. See, I can't because I lift too with that. Go on. Get going. I'll be soft. Do you want to roll? Yeah. I was a champion on the rowing machines in the gym, you know. I've knelt to these. Oh, we'll see. I can use them we'll rowing machines a, in the gym. We'll be like a power boat, Bucky. I a can use power them boat. I can. Next time. Oh, shit, you've just crashed us. What are you doing, Bucky? Being crashed us. I was pushing off. I the boat. Wow. You ready, guys? Because there's nothing to do like the three of us in here. Is it not? Nope. It's ready. There we go. You know you're going straight. I don't care. <laughs> That's We're going not fuck. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> He's going to lose the oar. Uh oh. He's going to lose the oar. Oh, it's not in. Yeah. I'm just too powerful for it. That's what it is. Too powerful. Right, you, you're going into the wall. Spin around. Are you ready? I say you spin around, Bucky. Yeah, that's what I was doing. Right. Guide me. You ready? Guide you. You're good. You know you're doing it wrong. <laughs> you only first put the oars in a little bit. You're splashing everywhere, Dan, because you're putting them in too deep. We're going faster. You get at the walk thingy if you don't slow down. <laughs> right, come on, you're getting silly now. I'm not getting silly. You are. You're nearly losing the oars. Oh, there's Josh and Cody. Right, wait here for him. Hold on, hold on, don't spin around too quick. I'm going to. Uh, there's Josh and Cody over there. Right, let's. I'm gonna try and get us over there. I'm gonna go backwards, you ready? Oh. <laughs> no, we're gonna hit this rock. Oh, oh. Oh. That's the problem when it catches on that. Yeah, I know. Slowly does it. We're off. Oh, no, oh, oh, oh. Sorry. Sorry. 
<laughs> you hit the wall then, Josh. Alright, what's happening, man? We just hit some impact. In a, a salt mine. Imagine, no the, imagine the salt falls down. So I find it's a bit more difficult than I imagined. Everyone's crashing into each other. I don't know what Josh is doing. Take a look at Josh. What is he doing? He looks, he looks like. Oh, I heard that echo then, did you? Yep. Don't be making a cave in, Dan. Remember, no shouting in caves. Like you always say. This one seems more it, safe though. It, it might be salt, but you never know. Hold on. It's like a rowing race, you're splashing everyone. Covering everyone in salt. Well my uh I thought we'd go around on uh, like a motorboat but it seems like these, uh, this technology isn't quite capable of handling my strength uh, at this current time. Hopefully they upgrade the system so that people like me can get around here a lot faster. I just think he's better than rowing. No, I don't think I'm better than anyone. I just don't want to be smashed full of water like Dan's doing. Bucky doesn't get sarcasm either. He, he seems to think I was being serious about me being the strongest man on the planet no, rowing. about how strong you think you are. Uh, who won? Who won on the punching machine? Well, you did. Exactly. That doesn't mean. So we are going to start making our way back to the docking station. We've been taking some epic photos. Make sure you check out Instagram.com/slash Exploring Me Fires and Instagram.com/slash Exploring Me Bucky. Guys, watch. I always document my first world experiments, and I always get scared every time. And these one actually, they shake hard. Whoa! Let's just. Keep it chill. Yeah. Just keep it chill. Just keep it chill, boys. Let's just enjoy our salt mine Ferris wheeler. Uh, Ferris wheel of death. Yeah, Ferris wheel of death. <sighs> just sit back and relax as we go into the sky. Bucky couldn't do it. He ran off. He ran back out to the top. In fact, he wanted to get on them stairs before we do. Because he said the less the weight, the less chance of us collapsing. I suppose Bucky might live longer with that kind of. Uh, Thoughts, but this is a good picture for you guys. Up there. Yeah. Oh, bro, don't do that. Oh, what the fuck? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Alright, stop. Okay. You want to go for me? Oh. <laughs> I'm not enjoying this yeah, one. Bit. I don't like this anymore. I want to get down. I just forgot that it stops, and when it stops suddenly, the thing just spins. Oh, man, okay. Alright, you got it, bro. Over. Slow, oh! Slowly, slowly, Josh. Okay. Oh my god. Slowly. We're not even that high. I don't care. We're rocking. Yeah, it still shakes around, man. I hate heights. You know that. Well, we are right at the top. I don't like this, Josh. I don't like it one oh, bit either, either, man. I don't. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. oh. We are right at the top right now. Alright. Don't move, Cody. It has now stopped at. It has now stopped directly at the top. I mean, the, the biggest problem is Cody. Cody is such a big guy. The slightest movement he makes, it shakes the whole thing. Cody. Cody, don't. Stop move. flexing, Cody. <laughs> <laughs> no! Like, no! <laughs> well, the Romania road trip is almost over. We've got one episode after this, and then it's back to the UK. But don't forget, I didn't even do anything in the UK when I got home. I went straight to Ireland, so we still got another Ireland series ready. And then, I think, we're going to France in January 2019. That is right, I am finally doing the Paris Catacombs. Yeah, I'm a bit nervous. People actually live down there and they hate tourists. They hate people going down there with cameras and filming. People have been robbed down there. So yeah, I have no idea how it's going to be, but we're going to do it. 2018 has been such a special year for me. I've had some amazing times, made some amazing memories, but 2019 is going to be on another level. But towards the end of December, I'm going to be putting out some special episodes. Uh, one of them, I managed to find a video, and I'm talking a video tape, not a, not a CD, not a memory card, not a file. It was a video tape of me exploring a place called Whittingham Hospital back in 2005. 
it's such a terrible video, a terrible explore, but it's there and I'm going to make a special episode on that and I'm also going to compile some kind of complimation episode that shows all the best bits from 2018. Oh and one last thing, if you want to see me explore anywhere, country, place, anything at all, leave a comment below right now, tell me where you would like to see me go. Again, there's another it's just a noise, the hell out of me. People cutting in the line, we're waiting for an elevator and the family just cuts in and it's like no one says anything to him and I don't want to say anything to him because I'm in a foreign country but you wouldn't get that in the UK. So right now we are leaving, it's done. It's been exhausting. The amount of steps we have we'll have to walk up and down, the heights we've had to deal with, the rides we've had to conquer, but we did it. And that was such a fun place to visit. I highly recommend people coming here. It is a beautiful spot and it's so much fun. Just watch out for those people pushing in line. So definitely make sure you check out everyone else who are exploring with Josh, exploring with Cody, exploring with Bucky. And we are going to the most haunted forest in the world right now. Stay tuned for that.